Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first video, hi, I'm Elena, and this is The Organized Money, where we talk about planning life and managing money. Today is day nine in our How to Start Planning Your Life series. And in today's video, I'm going to be diving into my health and wellness planner. So if you've ever wondered about the purpose of having a health and wellness planner, it's basically a spot that you keep in your planner where you keep track of how you are taking care of your body and your mind. The reason why I feel like this area is so important is because a lot of times we will neglect our feelings, our moods, our body, our health overall, but you only get one, right? You only have one body, one mind, one life, so you definitely should be taking care of it. So you guys know that I am a functional planner, so normally I don't have many stickers, especially in this one, because I I use this planner mostly as a tracker. I don't do much pre-planning in this area. I am basically kind of keeping track of what has already happened. But for the sake of this video and this particular week, I am going to actually decorate this week and use some stickers to make it look a little pretty. So while I'm decorating this spread, I am going to give you some ideas of different things that you can keep in your health and wellness planner. I decided to use some winter stickers in order to make it look a little bit prettier. I'm just going to use um, some Christmas type style stickers because we're in the month of December and just kind of lay them across my page. Now I'm trying to put them in spots where they won't cover up too much space because like I said, I don't normally decorate this planner so I don't want to put too many stickers down so that I still have the space to write in all the things that I normally write. If you're new to health and wellness planning, then you might be thinking, what would I need to possibly put in this type of planner? So I wanted to give you some ideas of different things that you can actually put into your health and wellness planner. The first idea is your meals. I do like to keep track of my meals in my planner. Now, I don't plan for what I'm going to eat. I usually plan for what I'm going to eat in my home planner, but I will keep track of what I actually ate in my health planner because sometimes everything doesn't fall as I have planned. I will plan one thing and then eat something else. So I do like to keep track of what I have eaten in this particular planner. The other things that I will keep track of are my weight, my workouts, my mood, my energy, my sleep, pain management, my self-care, and doctor's appointments. So when I am going to the doctor, I do like to take my planner with me. Then that way I can kind of keep a log of everything that's going on with me. And then I'm able to clearly explain how I was feeling on a particular day, what I ate, what you know, I'm what workout I may have done. And then that way the doctor has way more information to figure out what's going on with me. So just to give you an example, this planner was huge when I was having consistent migraines. I used to get migraines all the time and my doctor was able to track it to something that I was actually eating. And once I removed that from my diet, my migraines went away. But had I not had this planner and noticed that every time I ate a certain food, I would get a migraine, then I may not have realized as quickly that that's what the link was. So I would definitely suggest that you use a health and wellness planner to help you stay on top of all the things that you may need to continue to take care of yourself. Like I said, we only get one body, one life. We want to make sure that we are taking care of it so that our quality of life is the best that it can be. So guys, I hope that you have enjoyed this video. I know that this was a quick one, but I really wanted to jump into and share how a health and wellness planner could help you with your overall quality of life. I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. And until then, keep organizing your life so that you can achieve your dreams. Bye guys.